Got my new LED lights and my assistant. Huh? You don't? We'll go upstairs then. Purdy. Got heat sinks on it. Oh, that's for turning and daytime lights. What the heck is this? Got a little ballast? <laughs> oh, adapters. Oh. Apparently, you can mount these. Jeep Wrangler headlight instructions. Open the hood, take it out, go on a thing, connect the lights. For, uh, looks pretty easy. And then these driving lights. Oh, are you kidding? Look at this. This one doesn't have a plastic cover covering it and it's all scuffed up. Good job. These things never work the way they're supposed to. You gotta pull a little red tab out. Then you can squeeze. Yeah, pull this out, and then you can squeeze this. There's dirt in here. Gee, I think I'm gonna paint this too. It's got a little clip too. Which does it look like? This? Yeah, it looks like that. Is there a left and a right? I don't think so. Turning. Oh, yellow's turning. And white is angel eye. Isn't that cute? They use a waterproof there. They don't use a waterproof there, and they use a waterproof there. I'll run these up here for now. this it looks like my guards are not going to fit on these because it's so much thicker I can use these guards except if I do use them 
I think it's going to block them lights. So, no use using longer screws or anything else. I just use the old rings that I took off. Thank God I saved them. They look like a pretty high quality build. I ran the wires through to the back. Instead of wiring this ring on the accessory when it comes on, I you didn't see that because the battery died on my GoPro. I ended up wiring these to the running lights because I don't want them on all the time, driving down the road or whatever. The side marker light that went here, I tapped into that, which I, this doesn't have, of course, since I cut the fenders. All right, they're both in. I'm going to take these guards off, too. Maybe I should do a giveaway with those. Maybe someone wants those. They're basically brand new. I just put them on a couple months ago. Gotta love the way these Jeeps come apart so easy. Everything looks good. Someone said they use these in Harleys. I wish they were glass. That's important. I also got my speaker upgrades for the back. I'm going to do that next. That's my next video. Alright, let's see. First, the running lights. Ooh. Isn't that pretty? That's running lights. Lights on. Low beam. That's low beam. And high beam. And high beam. Which is the bigger, lower one. Wow, they look pretty bright. Let's see what it does tonight. <laughs> it was a pretty good movie, I remember you. Yeah, you have enough time. What's up, motherfuckers? And for all the hate that I've been getting about cutting these fenders, look at the scratches. I clear coated over a bunch of these because this is so bad. This was pretty abused when I bought it. I like the way them fender flares look cut. Figured if they ended up fucked up, I would just buy another set of fender flares. They're cheap, a lot cheaper than the aftermarket you know, flat flares and all that crap. I like it.